Hello everyone, Razor012YT here, and today we are going to be discussing how and why GRG fell flat on its face. Yeah, I found out why. And this is the whole story, yeah? Before we begin, I just want to tell you this. The GRG community is a walking zombie. The game is still well and alive, but its community is long dead. The proof? Th there is no channels on the GRG Discord server. I came to check on it the other day. I was like, what happened to the server? Did it die or something? I investigated this until I saw the group, and I saw the group wall. Then I found one notable guy who blew up the GRG server. And it was somebody that was a knight commander at one point. Matty. Yeah, yeah, that guy. He nuked the GRG server. Now, I am not a big fan of people blowing up Discord servers. I condemn this behavior. But before we actually get into the nitty gritty, we are going to... Look back on what caused the first fall. Back in good old 2022. And I think you're going to like this part. Because Refrigerator Man made a couple of lines here and there. Before before I just didn't make that part of the video. So now that story is going to be put on. So Refrigerator Man, please take the stage. Hello everyone. I am the Refrigerator Man. And today I have made this video in response to what happened within the game generic roleplay game and how it had a very but mostly rotten fall. Basically, I have to give credit to this guy named Arslan along with Cheese Guy for explaining everything to me, so shout out to both of you for explaining the entire story. Now, without further ado, let us begin our guide into the mostly rotten fall of GRG. First, what caused the entire thing to happen? Basically, what happened is first, Asian Dibs the owner and creator, stopped updating GRG for a long while. All while at the same time, the community was getting bored of the game at this time. However, around this time the mod team began to have some problems. One of the mods were abusing and even warned someone for using a Palestine flag reaction. Yes, the mods were literally acting like Discord mods over a simple flag. And to be honest it was very stupid. Another moderator was the opposite, but he did nothing at all. So a group was formed to take down the two mods and it was called mod purge supporters. The group started to riot in the discord server, and spammed a video of Squidward from Spongebob saying mod purge. Evidence was collected against the mod, and was put on probation for two weeks. However, the moderator left anyways from the server on his own because of the incident. After this, a series of reforms began to be made against the mods, and then, the community patched together evidence against the second mod, then the group got renamed to the generic anti-corruption organization or the GACO for short. After the evidence was made against the second moderator, the second mod left in fear of being targeted. This was one of the greatest attempts to stop the corruption in generic roleplay game and bring the game back to where it was. However, fear efforts were all in vain, as people began to crap on the document that got posted. Meanwhile, the exploiters, usually managed by the very inefficient anti-cheat along with the moderator team, began to rise in numbers. Notable exploiters like Examen and Wormwood started to pop up because of the lack of exploiter protection. Now, we will move on to part 2, of this entire situation. The mostly rotten fall. During this time, radio silence was starting to emanate from the devs, admins and Asian dibs the creator of generic roleplay game. Then, high level users began to leave the server as their most active, and high level users began to leave the game. That was until on September 18, 2022. Three high levels remained to try to keep the group together. And then, they left people started to crap on the admins along with Asian dibs. Meanwhile, during the whole incident, this happened. People were planning to go into pretty much every border game ever as refugees. After some time, people began to follow and being quote unquote, refugees into border. Then a bit more time passed and Mr. Underscore Wiggles caught wind of this and after that, this announcement got made. It says, hello and welcome forbidden game refugees, I hope you enjoy your stay. The community soon got the attention of border staff and soon took them in as refugees. Thank you, Refrigerator Man, for taking the stage. I will be handling things from here. So, anyways, when 2024 came around, all the following events have happened, as said by Mati. 
Now, the first thing Marty says is April 1st. AZ and Reyna got doxxed. The community server temporarily shut down to prevent people from spreading the sensitive info. At first, people thought this was an April Fool's joke, but it was not an April Fool's joke. A week later, they announced the full shutdown of the community server and started to shut down other stuff involving them, other community servers, websites, etc. A strictly reports only server was announced that was a work in progress. Did that server ever come to fruition? Probably not. Who knows? A week after that, on April 13th, a staff only announcement was made that the server was ready for staff and they could choose whether they wanted to test or moderate the new server. Originally, this was when Marty was originally planning to nuke the whole GRG Discord server. A week after that, him and a few other friends decided that he'd do an in-game ma mass ban on thousands, if not tens of thousands of accounts as a way to get revenge on the unacceptable things as it did earlier. He has still people asking him for a ban reason and unbans to this day. Originally, he intended to reside in a peaceful way. Those friends got news of this and unfortunately... He was roped into the group chat and the rest was history. But anyways, folks, this should explain everything, hopefully. If there is really anything resembling GRG, all there is is just the game. And plus, there is like over like 600 people playing the game, like as of right now. And there's really no community to back the game, except that... The community there, I'm not sure where it even is. Maybe it's in a fan server, maybe maybe it's somewhere underground. I don't really know, but yeah. Anyways, if you have liked this video, please comment, like, and subscribe for more Razor content, and I'll be seeing you then, so good day, good night, and I'll see you then. Bye-bye.